Copper's Cove teen who faced many medical challenges was not only able to graduate with the rest of his peers, but excelled while doing so. Trent Davidson was recently given the District Exchange Club's Ace of the Year Award. In this week's Heart of Central Texas, I spoke with both Trent and his mother on what the honor means to them. 18-year-old Trent Davidson has not had an easy life. Since he was born, he was diagnosed with uh, Infantile scoliosis, um, which we later found out was a connective tissue disorder. That's called Beal syndrome. He's had at least 15 surgeries on his back. His childhood was full of doctor's appointments and sometimes weeks off from school for recovery, but he never let that stop him from being successful. I think a lot of it was the people that I had around me. I had some great people um, just all around me, uh, whether it was friends or family or advisors. Davidson graduated from Coppers Cove High School in the top 10% of his class with a 4.25 GPA and a score of 1380 on his SATs. I have no idea where he gets it from and he's just a self-motivating uh, student and child. That motivation did not go unnoticed. He was recently awarded two scholarships totaling $3,500 for the Accepting the Challenge of Excellence or ACE award. Th this is just basically building my future in a way that I didn't know I would be able to do it prior. So having the scholarship there allows me to go into my freshman year knowing that uh, I don't have to put so much of it on myself and I'm super grateful for that. Apart from academics, Davidson was involved in many extracurriculars, volunteering more than 100 hours in football management, UIL academics, student council, and class officer. There are people that have supported me um, for nothing. Like they were doing it out of the kindness of their hearts, and I think it was only fair for me to do the same thing in return for everyone else. His mother says Davidson wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the generosity of others and thanks everyone who played a role in his life. And without blood donors, then he wouldn't be here right now. Um, achieving his dreams. So um, that'd be one thing, just get out there and donate blood and make kids' dreams come true for one day when they grow up. Trent Davidson heads to Texas A&M in the fall to study mathematics. Stay with us, your morning rush.